Hello everybody, I'm Blazer Rebecca and welcome back to Tokyo School Life. You think it wouldn't suit your style, huh? What? But Karen, you love this cute stuff, don't you? Apparently she's oblivious to her surroundings and what she says. What? That was supposed to be a secret? Well maybe you shouldn't go around saying cute, 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 cute all the time. Come on, just think about it. Karen's eyes have always gotten sparkly when seeing something cute. So it's just normal to assume she liked that kind of stuff. If you like it, then what's the problem? Tall like you? Tall like you? I really can't tell if you're tall. You're a fictional character. A realistically speaking, you should probably taller than me. Oh, so that's the issue. I guess Karen is tall with a slim build and a good figure. She looks more like the cool type than the cute type. If you, if you like it, then that's all. It, yeah, why not? Yeah, maybe you're right. But as long as you like it, you like it. That's what matters. Karen sighs deeply. Aww. Of course I know her! Mitsuki, aka Kiribashi Mitsuki, Japan's top artist who's active all around the world. They call her the black haired princess. Her exotic style of leather fashion with a touch of Japanese taste has drawn fans in many countries. I have some of her songs on my phone. What? No way! The same Mitsuki? What? Hold on, I can't believe it! That Mitsuki? Really? I gotta look up some videos later! Hmm. I can't really imagine that. Nah, I can see how that suits you. It doesn't surprise me at all. Wow. Way to piss a girl off. Uh, please go on with your story. Sorry. This kind of game is like basically ways to piss a girl off. <laughs> That's the moral. <laughs> You saw Mitsuki, right? Mitsuki, right? <laughs> I predicted that line for some reason. <laughs> this is adorable, though. Yeah. With what? I don't even have to ask that. I know, Karen fell in love with cuteness. Karen looks in trance as she remembers the past. And then you decide to be an idol, right? <sighs> Cruel fate! Karen sighs deeply. I see, so that's how it went, huh? Let's see. I get it. I understand Karen's situation fully. I hold Karen's hand. Well then, let's go to the store. But that's just to do with your work, right? You've got the day off, so it doesn't matter. Your hobbies are your own personal choice. 
中途半端は自分で許せないっていうかあんた力強いわね<笑> I drive Karen into the sweet lolly cafe Welcome The interior of the stress is calm wooden design The side facing with the street with a big window is a cafe and deeper in the store there's lots of frilly clothes on display All the staff are wearing frilly sweet lolita clothes so there doesn't really seem to be a uniform. It's more like they're all wearing the outfits they want to. All the workers are really pretty. Most of all, they all seem overflowing with confidence that just screams, I'm cute! <laughs> yes, that's exactly where it is. You've died and gone to heaven. <laughs> See, you're glad you came in, right? Are you looking for some clothing today? Or would you like to rest in the cafe? Can you try on clothes here? Yes, of course you can try them on. We we'll also give you advice on putting your outfit together from scratch. Please try out how fun Lolita clothes are. <laughs> oh, come on. Okay, one new customer guy is coming right up. Your boyfriend can order something while he waits, okay? <laughs> oh my god, you misunderstand, madam. The sales girl takes Karen into the boutique space. Okay, I'm not her boyfriend though, just her family. You misunderstand everything. The chef girl recommends various outfits to Karen. All of them are so pink and frilly, it's amazing. Hey, the workers are getting excited. Now more of the staff are gathering around. They start arguing about what's best. Well, I understand how they feel. Karen's really beautiful. It makes sense they want to dress her up. And I'll see you in the next part. See ya!